Lights account for almost 20% of the world's energy use, but that number could be drastically reduced thanks to the impact of LED lighting. Dikenda McGehee explains why it could mean, quote, lights out on a technology that's been around for 140 years. The incandescent light bulbs that illuminate our streets, offices, and homes once accounted for a significant percentage of global lighting sales. But the shelf life on this bulb is a short one. A U.S. federal law which took effect January 1st will end production of the 75-watt light bulb. Retailers can sell leftover stock, but manufacturers can no longer make them. It's an effort to save energy and reduce waste. About 90% of the total energy that goes into the light bulb actually gets converted into lumens or light as we know it. And the rest of it goes into, into heat. And the way you know it is you touch an incandescent light bulb, it's really hot. So you're saying 90% of it is used as energy and only 10% is light? Was That's that correct. correct. That's a big waste, right? It is. And that is why when this particular uh, uh, you know, law was passed, the idea was that uh, they wanted to have, they wanted to improve the energy efficiency of lighting. And those greener options include CFLs, also known as compact fluorescent lights, and LEDs, light emitting diodes. LED lights can uh, last, you know, 10 or 20 years. The, the lifespan of an LED is, is so remarkable that, that, you know, that there's some uh, you know, tremendous economical be economic benefits. Which market research firm IMS Research says could be worth $100 billion in global energy savings over the next five years as countries adopt greener technology. So what you see here is an LED uh, light. The firm's recent report on the global lighting market predicts by 2016, around 15% of all lighting will be accounted for by LED, which would reduce global energy consumption of lighting by around 20%. Every few years you will see the life of an LED will go up. I'm just thinking in five or 10 years, Somebody is going to make an LED light bulb that lasts 100 years. This phasing out, says the founder of UCLA's Smart Grid Research Center, will usher in a much brighter future. Yekenda McGahee, CCTV, Los Angeles.